I haven't played Shieldred maybe in this whole iteration. I don't know if I've ever had it. I could pick it here. Shieldred or Wheel of Fortune? What do y'all want to see? Votes are split. I haven't had Wheel much either. Wheel ain't coming back, man. I'm kind of wishing I took that wheel. I could still take Saga, I guess. I could take Fast Bond to try to play like draw sevens with Shelly. This is going to go poorly. Don't let me draft any more fucking green cards. Oh my god, I don't want Strip Mine. I really don't. I know where this is going if I take Strip Mine. It's so bad. I, I hate the strip mine stuff. It's so bad. Now, oh, what do you want? Crop rotation? You guys are going to yell at me. Like, you didn't take crop rotation. That's why you didn't win with your, de with your strip deck. You guys are fucking wild. How can anybody pick crop rotation there? Now what? Rot farm? Fucking omen? Rot farm seems perfect for this deck. I don't know this pick in all seriousness. It, I would probably pick Cobra here. I'm not picking Life from the Land, but I could pick Cobra, Green Suns. Maybe you could sell me on Library. You guys really want Library? I mean, I'll take it. I don't care. Uh, do I have to take Zurin Orb now? Seems like it. Could just take Garrick and have a good deck. None of these cards look playable to me. What, pray tell, do you want an intuition for? For Crucible stuff? I don't, know, I don't care. Just another way to tutor the strip mine if I can replay it from the graveyard. Do I want a Simic Growth Chamber? I don't know how those lands work. Permission to take a Mentor. Supposed to take Knight or Grazer? How can you not want Mentor in this crop rotation? Mentor is sick. I guess Depths. Everybody likes Depths. For no reason. Is Greaves good with Depths? That's cute calling this a tutor, by the way. Another Bouncer? There's the loam that I don't like. All right. I like Mox Diamond, but maybe that's stupid when you have fast. There's Ramunop. There's a fetch land. Do we like Mox Diamond? Then fine. We got the Mox and the Grazer. Right. Honest to God, no, no clue here. There's a Beseju, doesn't seem great. There's a High Art, doesn't seem good. Maybe I'm just misthinking about you like High Art. Yeah, whatever, I guess. There's nothing else here I like. Golos for Strip? I could, I could buy that. No, says Mac. He never even considers it. There's two fetches. There's a triome. Right now, I'm not casting any other colors. There's reclaimer. You actually want the reclaimer here? All right. I figured I'd wheel that. There's Ren. Ren seems nice. There's Oracle. Ren, let's go. Okay. Can't cast it at the moment. Can't cast Shieldred either. There's a black red land here. What the hell do we want here? Is this something I want? This dryad? There's Valakut. If that's something you want. There's Overgrown Tomb. There's Dryad. Like, I have no clue if Dryad is even good. Dryad. Can we not take the Court of Garenbrig? That would be nice if we didn't have to take that. 
Nissa fine. Are we trying to play any of this stuff? The loam or the shieldred? Courser? Is Courser good? I mean, it says land on it or whatever. So we're not even trying to play shieldred, huh? I think. I guess there's Brawler. Right now, I don't have any way to work this Dark Depths. I mean, do I want to just take Questing Beast? Or is there something else you like here? Yeah, probably not getting... Do we want that Golos or just take Besaju? Mac, they want Golos. We want Nyssa? Hell yeah, we want Nyssa, apparently. Anything there we want at all in this pack? I'm going to take fire. We got the Calicut. I ain't seeing a lot. <laughs> nice Titan. You guy's a fucking crawl worm. That is horrible. Is that really what I'm taking? I fucking hate Primeval Titan. Colossal Dreadmaw, first pick. You think I'm going to play this Valakit because I got a Dryad? I hope I'm not. Good gracious. I don't like anything here. What am I missing? Tell me what the pick is. Doesn't seem like a Jarden to me. I'd be surprised. Couple people are saying it. Why do you like jar, Mac? I'm I don't get the jar here. I'm gonna take it, but I don't understand it. Just because I have Fenny Spawned, I guess. I don't get that pick. I'm willing to take it. But that one I wouldn't have come up with. Tamio that I can't cast. There's an elf. Hex Mage for my depths with no tutors. And no way to cast Hex Mage. I'm I got no idea here. Tamio. Okay. Tropical, I reckon. Try to cast that Tamio. Or there's Katria. Katria Triumph's probably better. I didn't see it. Yeah, I think it's better. I see nothing that's that looks great here. There's a Druid. There's a Canopy Land that doesn't help splash anything. Is Valakit Exploration something? There's a Burst of Lightning. I don't know what it does, but I'm taking it. I already have two Bounce Lands, so unless we like really want the red-green one or a third one, keep that in mind. Probably the Log Grove here would be my guess. I've already got two Bounce Lands. I don't want three. Why do you guys want a third bounce land? I'm taking this one. I keep saying red green for no reason. I can't think of a reason. Do I need Omnat? I can't cast Omnat. I can't cast anything, really. I might just take Petal. Is Petal good? No, what? Uh, there's an Elf. There's a Sylvan. There's Grim Monolith. None of these look very good. We want Uro here? Or does somebody have a different idea? I like Uro here. I don't want to play this Hex Mage, right? Does Zurin Orb do anything in my deck? I don't know if Zurin Orb does anything. I haven't even started looking through all this stuff yet. Can't play Depths. I 
How did this get in still? Hold the phone. Why'd y'all like this jar? I forget why we liked the jar. These are my these are my go to. I don't think I want to play lumberjack, or do I? Uh, and a bunch of you want loam, I'll play loam. I don't think I want to play liberator. Locking up the mana for lumberjack. Do I want Golos? What does Zuron Orb do? How do I? I don't have any way to get the lands from my graveyard. Loan. But that's not good enough for a war, right? Well, you should have been here to save me, Pyra Hustov. You don't like Golos, it finds strip mine. Well, right now, I, I'm blue, green, red. I need to know if I'm going to play any of these. I'm not playing Valakut, am I? Do I want to play a second bounce land like the Rot Farm? I'm trying to figure out my colors for some car, for Terra Sunder. I need to see if I need black. Mac, how many bounce lands would you play? Would you play Valakut with only Dryad? But it only works with the Dryad, right? Am I missing something? If I don't have this, Valak, it doesn't do anything, right? Well, Beers is talking about the land. I don't even know what this does, but fine, it's in. How many lands should I play? Should I play a second bounce land? Nobody will tell me about a bounce land. <coughs> Field of the Dead is awful. Fine, I'll play the bounce land. That gives me another black source. Like, I could just throw this thing in to help with Terra Sunder, I guess. I can play that and sometimes have black mana. I guess I might as well play this land. And I don't feel like I need to play an off-color Horizon Canopy. I have a, a Grove, but I don't know. Mac will probably... Mac, Mac won't say anything right now when I'm sitting here asking. And they'll be like, you built it totally wrong. Strangle him. Kenny, it doesn't do anything. I don't have any way to, to do it. Not a single way. I don't know, 10 bucks, I'll throw it in here. I don't care. Well, it doesn't ramp me into anything. It's the top of my curve, essentially. I, can, I have one six drop. I just play a land and cast that. It doesn't ramp at all. It finds my strip mine or my Valakit. I can't really even use its ability. Very rarely. I don't have white. Yeah, I'm going to play this jar. And 18 fine lands, I think. Which might not be enough. 18 lands might not be... I might want more lands, but I don't know. How many land? Nobody will tell me how many lands to play. They'll just say, should have played 20 as soon as I start playing. They'll probably throw an obvious in there, too. Obviously, should have played 20. One wants 16, one wants 19. No wonder Beers and Mac are at odds. How am I supposed to cast my red cards? Do I need to play a mountain in my deck? Probably. This ain't really enough green, even. Nine green on turn one? That's miserable. My drafted petal. I ain't cutting it. I guess Mox Diamond's a tenth green. What card should I just... I mean, I can just cut Terra Sunder, I guess, if I don't need it. 
You're cutting pedal? Why are we cutting pedal? I thought pedal was sick. I want to play jar. I don't know why we want to cut pedal. I don't even know what exploration does. Should I not play Terra Sunder or should I play it? All right, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to give everybody some. I'm going to cut these two for Golos and the Green White Land. That's the deck. Can't play it, but that's the deck. Jesus Christ. So much for strip mine. Are you kidding me? That's the sickest thing I've ever seen. Of course, I draw Memory Jar next card. Yeah, it's gonna get there. Sand is so bad. Let's go! Well, this doesn't do much, but the hand's kind of cool. Who is Cat? Oh, 
Oh, maybe I should have shot Tef there. I should have shot Tef. That was bad. That was not wise. Nah, fuck spinning, I think. Certainly we're fucking spinning now. Oh, I just lost Ren. Fuck, I triggered that bitch again. God damn it. I think I'm dead. So that I can try to spin this guy eventually is the mox play. Because I don't need more green mana. Maybe it won't. I don't know. I can't predict a fairy. At least now it has to bounce the mox and not the golos. I mean, I think I want it to bounce the mox, don't I? I just can't really ever kill these flyers, I don't think. Yeah, I don't think there's anything in my deck. What can I even draw that would kill these creatures? Like a grazer can block one of them. Tamio? I just don't think there is anything. The fuck could Uro stable? I'm gonna need to Golos into like Uro, Dryad, and like something else. Fucking who knows. He's probably gonna prevent me from even doing it. Not yet, he hasn't. Alright, well. If I can draw the perfect combination of cards, I have a hard time believing the Dryad's going to stabilize me. I must not know what it does.
I don't have Uro mana. Oh, he can flip this, maybe. That might kill me. Oops. I don't think chumping with Golos is going to be very good for me either, but... Better than dying, I guess. I lost Nissa. I don't think that would do it if I had to chump with gold loose. I guess I get Burrow as well. I don't know. Not really with that. I mean, a few turns of it was fun. And then he played that Brazen Bar. After the Brazen Bar, I didn't have it. Also, it would have been more fun if the fucking, like, five people that helped me draft the deck didn't all run away after it was done. <coughs> I don't know what these cards do, honestly. They all wanted to play that one, man. Are you kidding me? Don't play this in case he disenchants it, I guess. You know, something happens. Can I just play the land? Yes. Oh, shit. Wait. It does it again? I can't play Prime U. So I'm stuck. And then what? He takes six or something? Ain't too bad, I guess. Oh, I should have loaned? Doesn't do anything. Or wait, I should pick this thing up. Shouldn't I? I can just pick itself up. I thought this would play another card. <coughs> I don't know what we have. Sager54, thank you for the raid. I'm playing this by ear. Oh, we should just ping him a bunch, right? Most of the time. I don't want to like, get bolted or anything.
Why not? Isn't he just dead to this? I'm counting like 19 damage under there. You guys are confusing me now. I'm in my combat. It was six damage when I used it a primeval. Oh, it's one damage? I thought it was six. Well, never mind. Your time out. I no longer know what I'm doing. Do I have that dryad yet? I'm gonna kill myself. Come on, I'm all alone. Kill your other lane. What was, how was anything infinite there? Then what changed? Oh, I could still run myself out of cards, right? And, but, cause I was gonna kill him. I get it. I get it. Golos didn't do anything. Crop rotation was sick. Well, I definitely wanted to strip mine so he couldn't break up the combo. I was going to strip him again, too. I was going to do the, uh, the thing. He goes first. I won that game. Well, I didn't... I was worried about exiling my whole deck, but that didn't matter with the Valak and I guess. Stings a bit. Yeah, but beers, I'm Chad Giga. When I, I just don't care. Mentor is brutal, though. What the fuck? Dak proof. If he keeps it up, I'll just ban him. I don't care. I just checked his info out. He's on the fence. Literally just looked him up. Some people earn the right to, you know. Other people haven't earned the right. He would be one that has earned no rights. He types D-A-T, that's not helping his case anymore, I assure you. I'd rather him fucking call me a fat motherfucker than type D-A-T, if you want to know the truth.
don't have a lot of blue sources, but that's what I'm going to need to get Uro going here. Chad always strip mines. That card really isn't going to help me. I can't win by just casting Jar or whatever into a deck. I'm going to need blue source for Uro. Uh-oh, I forgot about that guy. That could have been a reason not to strip mine. Forgot I had one card that turned strip mine into a blue source. Also not sure why opponent's not dacking. How good do your two cards have to be? To not want to loot here. I mean, if he did it last turn, he would have remanded me. Clearly, he just found remand, right? You counter escape, can't you? Yeah, it's a cast. But, I mean, he just fucking threw it. Did I want to decline him? I mean, I could have also bounced this on land or something, right? I, I don't know. Maybe I, maybe you're right. It does seem like he's working on trying to cast a spell with a higher CMC, though. Oh, cryptic. That's brutal. Uro life is nice though, alone, right? That's a pretty good one against the strip plan. Strip plan might be off for a while now. It has no cards, so that's not so bad. Maybe I'm not supposed to put both my bounce lands into play either. I don't know how I'm double strip mining. I can only play one land a turn. I mean, I can do a one turn with Uro, maybe. Doesn't Dak and does this? That's so weird. I guess I needed to leave from the loam first if I wanted to double strip.
don't think I can really loan them anymore, really, either, though. Yeah, Golos is scooped! I was gonna deck myself, probably. I got a match with that deck. League's always fire. You mean the 64 that's definitely not gonna fire? You can stipulate for that for 25 bucks for all I care. I ain't turning down 25 bucks. I don't wanna choose, you gotta choose my step though. I don't know how to, I mean, I'll stipulate artifacts. But that don't seem stupid. I mean, that seems stupid. That's fine. I can't kill a Magda. I'm kind of dead. It's not on Arena Alpha. You scumbag. hell does this hand even try to do? I don't really want to strip mine him. If I concede, I lose. So that doesn't seem to benefit me. Why do you want me to choose the winner before pack one? I thought you'd want me to choose the winner once I saw pack one. So it would give them a better chance. However you want to do it, but that I thought you'd want me to see the pack. That's how you do it. Intimidated him. Just a little intimidation tactic. Are there even board wipes in the in the cube? I'll choose one for sure out of that. The others sound awful. Like I would I, I, honestly, the other two just sound miserable. I'm just gonna sit and draft lands the whole time on either of the other two. It just sounds horrible. I think they all sound pretty bad, but if you're going to get enjoyment out of watching boardwalks, wipes, and a walker, I'll do it. Please just don't make me draft nothing but lands. Colos and 14 lands. For every land and gold card, I see. I mean, that's insane. You'd actually enjoy, like, watching that rook cap? It sounds just horrible. The last, the two and three sound horrible to me. Draft all lands, basically, in both. And one just sounds like a terrible time, but I'll do it for 25 bucks. At least I can have some choices in the draft. I'm drafting what I think is a bad strategy, probably, but I have some choices. And what, do I have to take, like, four different colors of board wipes or something? Like, shit, these might all just be five colors. You, you, you might... Are there red board? Well, I have to take like delayed blast fireball and like every planeswalker I see. Is that the idea here? Oh, he's got a soul ring. Well, there's a difference between board wipes and walkers and have to take all board wipes and all walkers that I see. But he's gone quiet anyway, so probably just not do any of it.
I'm afraid I'll mess that step up. I'll just forget it. The other two I'd rather watch paint dry, and that one you seem too particular about. I thought you just wanted me to draft a bunch of walkers. I, I don't want to have to take every one. I'm going to fuck it up. Just lost everything. Well, there goes the Valakit card. Rook Cap, the only way this is occurring is if you answer any of the questions I've asked you, which you've ignored. Like, do you want me to take... If a Planeswalker is in a pack, am I required to take it? Same with a Sweeper. Why would it be Mardu? What, aren't Blue have the good Walkers and control colors? What Walkers does Mardu have? I honestly can't think of any. I'm having trouble thinking of Mardu Planeswalkers. Well, then I don't think the step works. What can I do here? I'm losing badly. Maybe if I found a fast bomb like that turn, I could have done something. I don't know. Well, if you're either going to be here to direct me or not be but so strict on it, I mean, you know I'm going to pick sweepers and walkers, but if I'm sitting there with a fucking, you know, a, a, an Esper deck, I don't want to have to pick a double red sweeper that, you know, what I, that's what I don't want to do. What do I want with a rot farm? I thought I want to leave that one in my deck, probably. I don't know. And now, you and I Sager54, thank you for the subscription. Probably need to be able to Uro. We're off farm. Oh, well, yeah, I guess I could activate Golem with it. Thought I just wanted to err. I don't know. Uh oh. Now I'm fucked. So you're not gonna waste me? Oh boy, double fuck.
Does this do anything? Two four guy is exiled, I think, right? Yeah, fuck. Yeah, I should have left him in instead of Hex Drinker. Kinda of forgot about Tamio. I think I would have won if I left him in, probably. Tamio, get him back, play him fast bump. So if I can get 12 cards under here, that's also a win. I need a courser though, I think. I actually don't think that I can do all this, but maybe I can. I don't think so. I don't want to draw cards. Caleb D, thank you for the raid. I, I, there's a good chance I punt this away here. There's also a chance I don't even know what Valakut Exploration does. But I'm hoping that's not the case. There's definitely a case that I've miscounted all of this. I'm assuming if I get 12 cards under here, it deals 12 damage. That's my assumption. For starters. And then I need to see if I can even do that. Yeah, I can do the bounce land the next time. Oh, boy. That did it. I guess I messed it up. Well, I can play a land from under here, though. That might still be enough? I don't know. I might have messed it all up. Should still have exactly enough, I think. Or should I just get the bounce not, and not mess with the loom? Yes, I exile. I should. I forgot I had Tamio. If I would have just exiled Hex Drinker to bring back Uro, this would have been easy. I should just be able to put 12 cards under here and then it's lethal, I think. I can't count how many are under there. Oh, 
Hopefully it's going to be 12 and not 11. Right. Let's hope there's twelve. That was a little roundabout way of doing things, I guess. I'm always Cuban, man. Mostly I play those sixty four. Ha 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 